If you recently installed iOS 11, you might have heard of AR. AR was enabled through the App Store by Apple, and you can download tons of applications that enable this new feature to be used. So you can see here a lot of games available in the App Store, but if you go to the categories here where all the AR applications lie, you see a list of applications just keeps scrolling within every hour. Now, I wanted to share with you guys how AR works, how you can enable this, and get use of it on your iOS device as long as you have an iPhone 6S or newer. First application you're taking a look here, this video was filmed last night using AR with sky guide now sky guide is an application that you can point towards the sky depending on your location you'll be able to see the stars tap onto some of the stars get some information as well as the planets you also get some of the constellations this is all happening in real time as you can see the lighting in the background there for the city i am panning my iphone across the sky and you won't see the same thing i see because this is using ups and it's really telling me exactly what's around me the constellations in the sky and information in regards to everything that's surrounding me using ar the built-in camera and the application sky guide really cool application i highly recommend you check it out the next step i want to share with you guys is called stack now stack is a standard game in the app store that now offers ar capabilities and i have this yellow mat in the background because white floors or white backgrounds are not easy to pick up with ar it needs to detect uh, some sort of surface so as you can see here it's telling me to just kind of move my phone around to detect uh, everything that's around it just so it can give you that full experience with ar so i'm going to go ahead and do that here and once it recognizes the surface, I should be able to start playing here momentarily. Okay, so here we go. So let's go ahead and begin. And the goal here is to go ahead and stack these on top of each other without having the edges fall off. And as you can see here, it keeps growing and growing. And you can just get an idea of how this game works. Right there it is. So hopefully you guys can see this uh, well in camera. If I move the phone around, you see that... Uh, the building or the stack stays in place. It doesn't move around. So pretty cool stuff. And I can navigate through the surroundings. Pretty cool stuff. So it's kind of hard to show on camera, but I think you guys are going to really enjoy this game if you download it right now. And the last application I want to share with you guys is called Tape Measure. Now Tape Measure, of course, will measure the uh, distance between one point or another. So let me go ahead here and try to get the application to get focus here and detect its surroundings. You have to move your phone around several times. And once it detects the surroundings, you'll be able to start using the tape measure. Okay, so here we go. It has detected. I'm going to have a tape measure here with about a foot of tape measure and try to get this to give us an accurate reading. So if I put the tape measure there, I should get a foot of tape measure or measuring from this point to this point. It should be a foot right there. And there it is. It's accurate. You see there? One foot. So pretty cool. So one foot, it does measure properly the distance. So there's just so many applications for AR. Just wanted to give you guys a quick preview on how this works and how you can get this to work on your iPhone running iOS 11. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I'll see you on the next one. Peace.